my people it's your girl favorite chef ella i'm back here again to remind you that you need to be pampering yourself from time to time <laughs> and that is why i've chosen this particular soup okra and oba soup this soup they give me joy it's fresh blood as you can see everything is green <laughs> all right here are the ingredients for the soup but more already washed and cut into pieces my beef already cooked i was supposed to make this soup tomorrow yesterday sorry i was supposed to make this soup yesterday so i had to cook the fruit and the meat in particular then it didn't work out i put it back in the fridge so this is my stuck fish red oil the oba itself then the okra some crayfish seasoning cube fresh pepper onion and ugu leaf that is pumpkin leaf that is all so let's begin so the first thing is to since i've already cooked the beef so i'm going to like wash this stock fish now there is hot water in here so i'll wash it properly then i just poured the hot water so let me allow it to clean for some seconds or a minute so i have hot water here i added the stock fish so let me wash it quickly you no know, off camera then we'll begin I already have the stock fish in here, so I'll be pouring the pomo. I'm not adding onion, I've already used onion for my beef. Just adding one seasoning cube. I will add salt. Little water. So, I'll be adding small water, little water. So that the pomo has eating more that doesn't have sweet taste so as i'm adding just little water for the taste of the pomo to come out first it's going to be i am picking the pumpkin leaf now somehow i enjoy doing this like when I go to buy ugu from the market, I'll tell the woman, please man, just cut off the head. I don't want to carry load, but put everything for me. But sometimes when I'm in a haste, like I really want to be fast with my cooking. I'll tell them pick it, but I don't like cutting ugu at the market. How do you do yours, please? Like Sometimes I, I wonder, some people will come, they will buy Ugu, they will not tell the person selling, please slice it for me, like, ah, no, I don't feel comfortable, I don't feel comfortable doing that. How about you? How about you? You need to see me dancing like this. <laughs> I'm already sitting here. So this is my Ugu now, I've already washed it. Like, all the more says for this, this, this time. I don't want to waste time. It's not every time. It's not every time that you arrange your ugu before you slice. That's how I do mine. Like this now. You take it, just cut it from the middle. You then pack everything again. It will still give you a very nice. <laughs> You see how beautiful this pomo is. So now I'm adding the real actual water I'm going to use to cook. But remember, it's up pro, it doesn't need to. Be wrong. I think we'll start with this. This quantity is fine. So 
so as we go if there is need to add extra water so because i added extra water i'll still add more salt just little so that the taste of that bomo will not go away follow me <laughs> so i had like three cubes of seasoning cube i used wool at the beginning i'm gonna add one again so that this taste to still remain this way <laughs> that's how i do my know and it's magic on our so google Add the red oil. I'll pour everything I like. A red oil. Crayfish. These are beef ancient now. You see why I don't add much water at the beginning? Open this pot, we already see it. <laughs> oh, yeah, check. <laughs> All right, now I'll be adding this the oba. I'm adding it now I, because I actually bought the type that is almost fermenting. If your own is that fresh, you should add it earlier. I'm adding not crawl because I've already checked for the taste like it's okay. If I did not it's not, I would have added as in make sure that everything is okay before I add up because after you've added up, I don't think it's it's easier to correct any other thing. <coughs> Those soup <coughs> some people will some people will buy me a new card after eating this soup. In fact, some people will celebrate my birthday this February <laughs> because of this soup. My birthday is in October, but they will decide to celebrate me this February. You will see it. Watch out. Yeah. Fine. See this meat and como they are greeting you specially. <laughs> okay. Hey, hey, please hold me. Somebody should hold me. I'm fainting in my kitchen. I'm fainting. I'm fainting. What be cold water? What be cold water? <laughs> Don't stop us, call me. <laughs> Don't stop. So it's just like one minute after I added the okra. It's supposed to be fresh. The okra is supposed to be fresh. So I am adding the ugu. Another leaf you can use for those soup is so what they call it angara leaf got the egg leaf it's also super 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 super, 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 
so that's it i am turning off the heat now i don't even need to cover it to cook or whatever the vegetable is not supposed to cook this is how it's supposed to be so the heat is half and i also bring it out bring it down from the cooker because there is residual heat there which will make it to continue cooking so our opa and okra is ready ow <laughs> ow this is beautiful this soup is so cool. this soup is so delicious when you're making yours you can add more over it's your choice i'm okay this way okay please remember to like the video drop your comment also subscribe and turn on the notification so subscribe to this channel like comment also share share this video with your family and friends they will love it i know <laughs> don't deny them of this some shells meals that i'm making in this channel thank you guys i love you I